and today I'm going to show you how you can use straws to learn column method subtraction. We're going to start by working out 76 take away 34. I'm going to make the first number using bundles of 10 straws to represent the 10s and individual straws to represent the 1s. With subtraction we, we only make the first number. I've drawn a baseball which I've split into 10s and 1s. For 76, I'm going to need 7 bundles of 10 straws and 6 ones. Underneath, I'm going to show you the number being taken away. We are going to take away 3 tens and 4 ones. I'm now going to take away the second number from the first number. When you do subtraction, you always take away the ones first and then the tens. I need to subtract four from six. So I'm going to take away four straws and bring what's left down into the answer box. straws, 7 take away 3 equal leaves us with 4. 4 tens and 2 ones means we have 42 left. So 76 take away 34 equals 42. We can show this on the whiteboard without the straws. This is showing 76 take away 34 written as column method. Next we're going to see what happens when the second number in the balance column is bigger than the first number. We're going to work out 82 take away 58. For 82 we need 8 bundles of 10 straws and 2 individual straws. And for 58 I'll just stick on the numbers. first and then the tens. This time I have a problem. I need to take eight away but we only have two straws. I'm going to have to exchange one of my tens for ten ones and place it in the ones column. ones column and seven in the tens column. I'm going to take eight straws from the twelve and put the ones that I have left into the answer box. We can now subtract the tens. We have seven tens left so I will need to subtract five tens from my seven tens. We now have two tens and four ones, which is 24. So 82 take away 58 equals 24. We can show this as column method without the straws. When you exchange a ten for ten ones, you cross out num the number of tens and write how many tens there are now. So there were eight tens, but when we exchanged a ten, we were left with seven. Why don't you pause the video and have a go at Sim yourself? I'm going to give you the answers in 3, 2, 1. For 79 we have 7 tens and 9 ones. And I've stuck 4 and 5 for the number of tens and the ones below. We work out 9 take away 5 first which leaves us with 4 straws in the answer box. And 7 straws take away Four leaves us with three tens, which is 30. We can see this as written method without the straws. So 79 take away 45 equals 34. For 91 we have nine tens and one one. And I've stuck six and five beneath to show 65, which is six tens and five ones. This time we need to subtract five ones, but we only have one one, so we have to exchange a ten for ten ones. 
We now have 8 tens and 11 ones. 11 straws take away 5 is 6 and 8 tens take away 6 is 2 which is 20. We can see this as written method without straws. So 91 take away 65 equals 26. For 66 we have 6 tens and 6 ones and I have stuck 3 and 9 underneath to show 39 which is 3 tens and 9 ones. This time we need to subtract 9 ones but we only have 6 ones so we have to exchange a 10 for 10 ones. We now have 5 tens and 16 ones. 16 straws take away 9 is 7 and 5 tens take away 3 is 2 tens which is 20. We can see this as written method without straws. So 66 take away 39 equals 27. I hope you found that useful. If you did please like my video and subscribe to my channel. I'll be uploading a video with something new every week. See you soon. Bye.